There's a the fish. Ah! Oh. Lost it. Nope, lost it. Just lost it. We'll get another. Fish. You got our first fish? Yep. Yeah. 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 Yep. All right. Okay. <laughs> okay, folks. Back in the Adirondacks, Racket Lake. First fish. Uh, should, do you guys want to keep it? I can just throw it back. Catch and release, man. I don't Catch and release. release. All right, buddy. Go Good have, times. Go have a <laughs> I think I have a fish. It's small. Yep. Right here. Ah. Well, my my lure selection is good, I guess. Yeah. Hey guys, that was just a little uh, pontoon adventure. I'm here for a, uh, I guess it's like a belated bachelor party, but uh, brought all the fishing stuff, the, the kayaks here, but uh, we're not gonna take it out yet just on the dock here and uh, I feel like maybe we could even get something right here let's see I uh, something just bit my worm but I think it's too small so I, I'm downsizing see probably get like a bluegill or something Bluegill or red breast sunfish? Let's see. This one's kind of weird. Almost seems like a hybrid of some sort. I'm sure we'll catch more, so not too worried about it, but another fish. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not so, so sure about these guys. They, they seem different. It's like a, a mix between a red breast sunfish and like a, I don't know. This could be something new. Okay, gonna do some early evening fishing. It's about golden hour here on Racket Lake, Adirondacks. I think I can mention the name of it. It's a pretty popular spot. Uh, mostly, I don't know, it seems like it's a mix of public and private shoreline. But the private part means that we can try docks. I also see a lot of uh, fallen timber there's lily pads, that's what I caught that guy off the pontoon boat with, or from. And uh, so yeah, fish finder battery seems a little low, so I don't think I'm gonna use it tonight. I'm gonna focus more on, you know, stuff close to shore. But uh, yeah, beautiful lake. Water's getting calmer and calmer by the minute. And I think, I think we have a good opportunity to catch some fish here. I think I'll start with a Texas rig. Got one of those smart bait color changers on there. Got the bead, got the jig head, uh, the bullet weight, and the stopper. Oh, that's a fish. I got a fish on, but I can feel him. Yep, there's the fish on. This will be fun. Guys, I just lost one uh, 
got me under some sticks and uh, broke off. Uh, could have been pretty decent. Uh, could tell he was on there the whole time, but then he just broke me off. But now stuff is busting on top, so I'm going to switch from the uh, Texas rig to the Whopper Popper. This one, it's small. Very small. And I kind of snagged it. Well, all that effort, we get this little guy on the whopper plopper. And we kind of snagged him. And you can probably not really see him that well. There we go. Alright. Last night uh, was not the best. This morning started even worse. I don't even want to talk about it, but hopefully, uh, hopefully my phone's okay. Alright, so, we've come back to the area where I caught that fish yesterday. Um, there are some spots that I wanted to, uh, check out. Looks like they moved this dock, actually. There was one in the middle here, so... Well, anyway, I'm gonna start with, uh, the Whopper Plopper. Start the top water. And if nothing happens with this, I think we'll go back to that Texas rig. Alright, I'm going to go back to the Texas rig because this is what worked for me yesterday. But uh, the, the worm I actually lost the fish on last night was on this weird Strike King color. What do they call that? Sweet Tater Pie, it's called. It's a Strike King shimmy stick. I'm not sure the length on that. Maybe four and a half inches, five inches. Okay, found this little island here. I uh, think it's pretty deep up until pretty close to the shore. There's that grass. I don't know. It spoke to me. But of course he got off. But of course he got off. <sighs> fish, fish on, fish on. Oh, it's a good one. Net, net. It's another. Actually, that's a largie. Okay, finally things are happening here. Oh, mm, borderline two pounder. And more like a pound and a half, I guess. But he's a pretty little thing. again. I got him inside the boathouse. Some other fish. 
another nice larger. Yeah, I'm gonna let them run. Oh, that's a big one. It's a big one. It's a big one. Oh, come on, come on, stay on, stay on, stay on, stay on. Stay on, stay on, stay on. Stay on. Stay on, stay on, stay on. Stay on, stay on, stay on. Yes! Oh, that's a nice one. Oh, guys. That's a, that's three pounds all day. All day. Oh, yes. 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 Oh, guys. Oh. Thank you, Boathouse. Holy sh**. Oh my gosh, he's hooked well. Oh, he's hooked well. The only thing that could have failed there is like the the, the line breaking or something. Oh my god. Oh, oh, this guy's massive. Oh, holy sh oh. this is all, this might be PB level. I'm shaking, I'm shaking, I'm shaking. Okay guys, I'm just making sure you can see it. There's my fish. Okay, so it's like, it's a three pounder. It's a three pounder, it says 316, it's locked. Okay guys, here it is. Not bad, eh? Nice fish. Final view of that monster. Okay, let's let it go. Nice, big, chunky guy. There he goes. Look at that. Truck on a barge. My truck on a barge. That was unexpected. One of these, uh, I'm calling them red breast sunfish. I keep catching them. They look a little different to me, almost like some kind of hybrid, but maybe it's just a, a regional difference. Um, you know, I actually caught one of these this afternoon as well. Not on film. Coming back from my three pounder adventure. Pretty big mouth. Makes me think, I don't know, maybe it's something different. But uh, there he is. guys they're busting on top it's it's top water time we got the lunker hunt popper I like this guy I've had success in the Adirondacks with it before so I think that's what we're gonna do there's a fish all right well I can't even tell if it's a large mouth or a small mouth in this light. But I'm not going to mess with it. Okay. On the torpedo. Now, it's hooked in a bunch of different ways. So let's see if we can get them out, get them off. Little guy. There we go. Well, at least we caught something. I should go to this. These, these, this family's been catching crappies left and right. Like while I'm here struggling.